Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hold for yourself if you're coming across an Excel issue where it cannot open the file because the file format or file extension is not valid. So you just want to make sure first and foremost if you can access the file location. So you just want to go ahead and make sure it's a Microsoft Excel worksheet file type. So if you right click on the file itself, so I just on my desktop for my example, but it might be in your documents folder or external media source. But you just want to open up the file location for it and then select properties. Make sure opens with is selected to Excel and the type of file should be XLS X or something to that extent. So you just want to make sure again it's a Excel file here. Maybe that's part of the problem as well to make sure it's the correct file type. And if you're still having this exact error message, what I would suggest doing would be to right click on the file itself in question and select properties. Select the security tab. So again, select security and then select the edit option next to change permissions. Now that you're here, you want to go ahead and select the add button. In the enter the object names to select, you want to go ahead and just, you want to select the advanced button. Give it a moment to load up here. Select Find Now. And then go down to Everyone. And then left click on that one time. And then left click on OK. Select OK. Select underneath Full Control, or I should say across from Full Control, check mark inside the Allow box here. And then select Apply and OK. Now that you've done that, go ahead and select the everyone here. Just make sure everything is all checkmarked under allow. And now you want to select the advanced button again down here. Select everyone. So now that you've selected everyone, select the edit option. And again, make sure everything's checkmarked underneath full control here. And now that you've done that, go ahead and select OK. Select OK again to close out all this. And then if you open up your Excel file, it should be good to go. So I do hope this brief tutorial was able to help you guys out. And as always, thank you for watching. And I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.